I'm done living life with the lights out, die with my own time. Please and like and share our videos. Free. So after our close encounter of the elephant kind, the Phyllis and Four Wheels team headed south to Mound, where we were going to house it and do some repairs. So it's another damage report from the road. Ufudu has broken some leaf springs, one on each side. So we here in Mound um, getting some upgrades, or that's something I wasn't crazy about and a lot of people recommended it to me. So we're fitting some old man emo leaf springs um, and hopefully that will be able to manage the load the 2.8 tons that Ufudu is fully loaded Here you can see the damage done by the 2.8 tons that Ufudu is Both leaf springs had one leaf broken Good morning So we are in North Western Botswana at the Kibaha Caves. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. It used to be called Trotsky's Cave because the farmer that discovered it was Trotsky. I presume it's easier to pronounce. Karin is actually up this morning, just after me. Quite a nice change. Uh, making coffee for her and thinking back about the last a week or so where we've been house sitting in Mound. It was nice for four or five days but then I started getting cabin fever wanted to get back on the road and it was a great day yesterday driving here <coughs> getting back to traveling Strange how quickly I got cabin fever. Four or five days was enough for me. Did some video editing, washing, and everything. But after that, it was looking forward to driving again and heading somewhere new. So today, Karin's gonna be exploring the caves. Brilliant campsites that they have here nobody around big campsites and we are the only people here and you can see it's not being used a lot so if you close to this area it's well worth coming even just if you come to camp quiet another glorious sunset last night there you go so the good thing about bats is that they're not supposed to fly into you. Yeah, yeah. The, but the radar system. Definitely. <laughs> After Karin explored the case for our two, we had some route planning to do as we were heading to our second country on our trip, Namibia. And we could not wait. On our first day in Namibia, we found the Boabab route. This Twispur track is a lovely drive, passing multiple Boababs and through some nature conservancies. Camping next to these Boababs really puts life in perspective when you look at their size and age, which dwarfs even Ufudu, our trusted Toyota 4x4.
We visited the world famous hollow tree, an enormous baobab that hollowed out in the center and then split into three parts. of running into elephant herds on the way to a watering hole. These enormous animals following the same footpaths for millennia. And when I got to Walfus Bay I discovered that I've picked up a bacterial infection in my left foot and the foot has swollen up and I've developed a very high fever. Luckily we were visiting our, my friend Burnett and she kindly put us up while I recovered. While visiting Rolfus Bay we also had the privilege of visiting Rostock Farm, Burnett's family's farm where she is trying to establish a vulture sanctuary. The wide open spaces and the colors of the mountains took our breath away. sort out the last bits of Fufudu's repairs and to start thinking about heading north onto Tamara land and Angola, the next country on our list. Okay, so it's been a week and a bit since my foot looked like a watermelon about to explode and I am happy to report that um, after taking a course of antibiotics um, my foot is slightly smaller. Um, it looks like half a watermelon now. Doctor has given me all clear, said it will take a while. So although I can't wear shoes, so I can fit my put into a, at least into slots. Still not a pretty sight, but it's getting there. So we'll be eating the road, hopefully on Wednesday, heading north into the mile. Please remember to hit that subscribe button. If you would like to support us on Patreon, go to www.patreon.com, click the Become a Patreon button on the top right, select your pledge amount or you can enter your own amount. Then select a payment method, which could be PayPal or credit card. All pledges are appreciated. Thank you for your support.